Well, this week is full of stellar high school basketball tournaments in the Pacific Northwest, from the Boys Le Schwab Invitational in Hillsboro to the Girls Pacific Office Automation Holiday Classic in Portland. Fox Wells Nick Krupke has our high school spotlight tonight with a triple threat of sisters who play for the new number one in the state, the Clackamas Cavaliers. My grandma, she gets so excited. She's like, <laughs> all three mogul sisters are out on the court. And like, yeah, it's we've been looking forward to it since we were little. <laughs> The Clackamas basketball moguls are here for the now and way back when. Brian's first year of playing when like rec league, my mom was the coach. So Reese and I would tag along to all the practices and jump in whenever we could. Dress and leggings, we just jump yeah. in yeah. wherever they needed us. <laughs> the Boise born sisters moved to the Beaver State in 2008. I was only child, so like my mom had this like huge belly and I was like trying to get her to pick me up and she's like, no, like get away from me. <laughs> The Mogul twins, Dylan and Reese, are now sophomores. Ryan is captain and one of two Division I bound seniors, the top ranked Cavaliers. Big Sis will stay home to hoop it up on the bluff with the Portland Pilots. I think it feels good to just know, especially like knowing I'm going to such a good program and with such good people, I'll be kind of close to home and be able to keep watching these two, what, they're, what they've got going on, and like my brother. Like our family's super close. This 2023 run towards a state title is once in a lifetime. Missing most of our high school seasons, like freshman with COVID, sophomore with COVID, junior, like ACL is kind of like her one year. So I think it's super cool that like, even with everything she's been through, she still worked for it. Yeah. All three sisters also play for Northwest Select and have worked through knee surgeries. Ryan last season when Clackamas made the semifinals, Reese in the eighth grade and Dylan this past July. It's kind of an evolution, like you're kind of dialed. The first one is like trial and error. There's a little bit of experience with my dad doing it himself, but like for me, it was easier. The hardest parts are in the rear view with the best to come. I think she leads by example. Yeah. Like she's not going to ask you to do something that she's not doing herself. It's all love in the family until it's not. I think we probably like snap at each other quicker than we do with other teammates just because we're around each other all the time and it's more, I don't know, get so on each other's like, back a lot quicker too. Yeah. Like we're kind of each other's best friends. Like we always got each other's back. So I think that's something that's pretty special like mm -hmm. on and off the court. Best of luck of the Cavaliers looking to raise their first state title banner since the school opened up in 2001. In the home of the Cavs at Clackamas High with our high school spotlight, Nick Krupke, Fox of Oregon. Well, no matter the season, no matter the sport, Nick is always looking for standout student athletes to feature in the High School Spotlight segment. Just send up a note on who you know that's deserving of the honor. Just